All right, um, I imagine it's been a whirlwind for you. So the first question I'll ask you is just mentally, physically, after the draft, after, you know, realizing you're playing with Pascal, yeah. how were you feeling, you know, coming into Summer League? Man, I felt great, you know, I felt great. You know, I didn't have a chance to go to Toronto yet, but, you know, just the, they sent uh, uh, Coach uh, James, Coach Griffin in, to, in, in LA to work out with me. So they kind of prepared me from, for here. And, you know, I'm excited to be here, you know, first summer league, just be ready to compete with all the guys and, you know, just, just improve, get better and win as a team. All right, so you had your workouts in LA, now you're transitioning into Vegas. Um, talk to me about the conversations you've had in terms of expectations. Like, what do you feel the expectation is for you as a rookie? Because I know you want to contribute as much as possible, but they're probably trying to temper those expectations. Uh, I mean, I think it's not it's not a big deal for me right now. You know, for me right now, it's just uh, trying to get better, you know, compete. And every time I step on the court, just give everything I have. You know, I know coming in, I'm not going to have a big role. So I'm just going to try to be a star in my role and just do whatever the coaches want me to do and help the team win. So this isn't technically NBA experience, but it's your first NBA experience, a practice with the team. A lot of people talk about speed being the big transition, strength being the transition, or maybe it's the playbook. Your impressions of all three, speed, strength, and the amount of information you're being asked to retain right now? Uh, that's true. The, the, the NBA game is a little bit uh, like faster, but that's something we did in my in our, our, when I was at Arizona. That's the way we play. We play really fast, so I think I'm kind of used to that that tempo. And uh, now maybe the only concern right now is just the strength, strength power. You know, I'm continuing to get stronger, and I'm going to continue to get stronger. And you know, I, I'm used to it. I mean, I'm used to it. Uh, my whole life, I play against people stronger than me most of the time. So I'm kind of used to it. I'm going to just continue to to do my role, my my job, basically. And you've been working out with the team. How much different are the weight room workouts now compared to the types of workouts you were doing before? Uh, I, haven't ha I haven't had a, a lot of weight room workout yet. You know, like I said, I didn't have a chance to go to Toronto yet, but I just had one with. Uh, Coach uh, Lee, uh, you know, we're going to continue to work on my body, but I, I, I kind of work on my body when I was in L.A., and, you know, I'm just going to continue to get stronger and, you know, work on my body. Speaking of getting to Toronto, I know you had your teammates with Ben, who's from Montreal, but, like, what, he, what did he tell you about Canada, the expectations for once you get there? Man, uh, it was crazy that I got drafted to Toronto because we were always talking about it, and we were like, yeah, you, should come to, you should come to Canada during the summer. I was like, I'm not, I'm not going to Canada, like, during the fall or during the winter because, <laughs> like, I know it's cold, and, and he was like, man, it's the, it's, the, like, it's the best weather during the summer and stuff like that. He was like, let's say, like, let's, next year we're all in the NBA, and let's go back to Toronto uh, to, to, because he's from Montreal. Let's go back to Montreal, man. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be your guide and everything. And now I'm going to be like, hey, let's go to Toronto now. I'm going to be your guy. So it's going to be fun, you know. Yeah, and he told me a lot of good things about Canada, and, you know, I'm excited for sure. You guys sharing a lot about your experience here in Summer League and with your teams? Yeah, definitely. Definitely. We can share a lot, you know, just, just, just trying to suck, uh, suck in and just learn as much as possible.